For as long as you can remember, legends have been told about the derelict mansion upon the hill that cast a blanket of darkness over the town. The history of the house itself is virtually unknown. Even the town's oldest residents can't remember the mansion's origin. Being an avid hist history enthusiast, I embark upon the castle mountain, Bob of Mountain, to visit the manor, hoping to shed some light on the backstory of this crumbling fortress of darkness. Hey guys, and welcome to uh, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion HD Renovation. Uh, this game looked pretty neato uh, on Steam, and I was like, yeah, I can play that. It's spooky, and it's uh, cute and spooky all in the same breath as far as I've read. But uh, yeah, made by Albi Albino Moose Games. Just came out. So let's, uh, let's give it a go. Get all them spooks. Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion, a renovated version of the original Jump Scare Mansion. Endless mode coming soon. Uh, Car Amari Hospital. Build your own engine. Come eventually. Uh, so I guess I only have this mode. So how does one move? Oh, I see. Very nice. Hello, I am spooky. Hi, spooky. What up, girl? And this is my home. Can you fumble flare? Make it through a thousand rooms. Can you find? Is there any better? Because I don't really know. Anyway, just, just go. I will go. Yeah, maybe I should leave now while I can. Nope. So apparently a thousand rooms, eh? I only imagine what cute jump scares are going to come out at me. Well, let's, let's room. Oh god. I don't do well jump scares. Especially if they're cute. I have health though on a magic bar, so I don't even know what that means. But um ooh, a bed. Guess I can't sleep. Ooh, anything here? Anything at all? Nope. Probably should have looked at the controls before I started this game, but it is what it is. At least we got some windows now. Uh more beds. Another bed. Very pretty. Nope, nothing there. Alright. This isn't so bad. We're just going from room to room. There ain't nothing spooky in here. As far as I can see. Oh. Uh, ominous skull on the floor. What up? Do anything? Hold on. One second. Uh, input. Action binding. Up left side. Okay, that's all what it should be. Okay. Alright, sorry about that. I just wanted to make sure there wasn't any buttons I wasn't pressing. We're playing musical chairs now. I like it. I like all these rooms. Alright, continue. Oh, I don't like the spooky hallway though. That's pretty. Oh god. No. Oh god, I'm getting that shiver down my spine. I hate that. Because I don't know what's going to happen. But there are a lot of bunk beds in this house. I don't know what to do with the bunk beds. Scary? I call top bunk. I can't jump, so I can't do it. Oh, what's this? Read. Well, at first this place just seemed cute, but I've been here for a few days now. I'm feeling quite parched now, and I keep getting this feeling like I'm being watched by something. This is not romantic at all. Alright, so we have other people here. Maybe they're dead, though. So if there's really a thousand rooms, this is going to take a long time. Maybe I'll do a hundred rooms an episode, and then ten episodes? Sounds good. Yeah. I don't know if it auto-saves or not. I know something is following me, but I feel like I am prancing through the same rooms over and over, hopefully leaving notes as breadcrumbs. Will prove I am making progress and reaching some destination. I just hope I don't run out of ink. I am dreadfully thirsty. Don't drink the ink that kill you. It's all gross and such. But you don't know. Room 8. Okay. I don't know if I can die in this game, or I, I, I don't know much about it, and I like that about games. Okay, so I've got room here, room here. And down there. All right, let's let's try this room. Oh, this is gonna. I oh, I can get lost in this. As realized, room nine. Oh god, it's gonna be one of those types of things. Luckily for me, I've got a good sense of direction. I think. He says as he runs around and circle. 
Okay, um, well, I'm not going... I'm not going in a circle just yet. I hope not, because this would prove a boring video if, uh, if that be the case. Okay. Hmm. You know, about this game thinking they're going to be spooky things, and I don't see no spooky things. Okay, so that goes around the circle. Okay, good. I like it when eliminations are, uh, or when paths are eliminated in that sense, because I don't want to get lost. But I don't want something to follow me either. That's... Ah! Fuck. <laughs> I just got scared. Of some goddamn ice cream. Cute ice cream, too. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god. I just got scared by... It. That, that, that is ridiculous. I got scared by some fucking ice cream. Okay. That didn't happen. I'm a man. And little men don't get scared by ice cream unless they're diabetic or something or it's going to kill them. Okay. My first jump scare of the game. That's cool. Play cool hot shot. You got this. Look at this. A little room between rooms. Am I back where I came? Because this looks familiar. Oh no. No, because I didn't I would have noticed it's called there before. What up? They talking they say talking to yourself helps, but I don't know how much. There's a candle now. Can I take the candle with me? You keep guard, Scully. You stop that. He's following me. I don't like that at all. Okay, am I going in repeat now? Oh, is that his... Oh, I just want to read. Ink. Not quite quenching my thirst. Taste is terrible. Stains are terrible. I don't really think drinking was a very romantic idea. I don't think drinking was a very good idea to begin with. Just saying, buddy. You I found your body. Did I pick it up? Are there pickup buttons? Oh, the body is following me now, too. I'm waiting for the head to come flying out of nowhere. Anyways, uh... Spooky, spooky, spooky. Can't believe I got fucking scared by a cupcake or ice cream or dessert. I'm hearing lots of weird sounds too. If you're wearing, I recommend you wear headphones when you wear this too as well because uh, you can hear lots of weird ominous sounds that you may not be able to hear if you're watching this just on your mobile device or on your computer or whatever. I found something today to satisfy my own romantic thirst. I woke today from a brief faint and found before me a bottle of red wine. I'm not sure what brand or year, for all there's no label. All I can gather is that it tastes strongly metallic. Because it's not wine, you dingle dork. It's blood. It's blood. Well, I can do this all day. Anyways. Okay. Finding lots of skeleton bodies, but no heads attached to them. As long as none of the See, I'm going to say this now. Hope nothing jumps out at me. Oh, we're someplace new. Can I, see, I can't jump or anything. It's just all walking around. Now, I never played the original in this game. Don't know what system it's for. If it was for PC, or if it was for a console or something. But, um... Yeah. Now, left or right? Uh, Snake says go left. And in mazes, you should go left, so... Go left. You don't know who Snake is. Feel bad for you. Okay. So am I going around in a circle now? Back in these windows, we'll find out. I mean, I'm in room 28, so I don't know if... Um, I, now, if I go back, will it be the same room, or is it just, like, changes each time? Nope, this is all new. Oh, this is new. That's spooky. Uh, let's continue with our left. This left is good. More skeleton bones. And then another note. I don't think that was wine. That's what I'm saying, buddy. I knew it wasn't wine. I told you that as soon as you said metallic. Blood, if you don't know, tastes like pennies. There's so the iron in it. What this? I don't know how much longer I can go on. I haven't seen any of my previous notes. So that means either I'm getting somewhere or someone was taking them. Probably you're getting nowhere. Who knows? I mean, I'm getting somewhere. I think I'm reading notes that I've not seen before. So, who knows? Um, we got a long ominous hallway. Nothing's gonna scare me. Yeah, piece of cake. I'm not afraid of nothing. Not a, not a damn thing. 
I say that as this looks familiar. I wish I could peek around corners because this is, yeah. See, nothing to worry about. Just doors. Okay, we're already in room thirty-six. Wait a minute. I've been here before. Have I not? Ah, these bones don't fall. They all follow me. Oh yeah, this is different though. I don't remember any of that. Yeah, this is claustrophobic. Um, hmm. Let's go right for a change. Well, no, you know, what? let's keep going left. Change my mind in a quick second. Something else. I think this is my last note. I'm gonna die having never found my escape. But really, that's not true. This place was like my escape. My escape from everything else. In the end, my death was kind of romantic. What's with you and your romanticism? And also, there was plenty of rooms you passed by that had windows. You could just jumped out the window and been done up with it. Not to kill yourself done with it, but that is scary. Oh, okay, never mind. You just, when you step back, it just looks like nothing. A chair to hang myself with, but nowhere to hang my noose. Gotcha. Was that picture there the whole time? I wasn't looking, so I wasn't, I'm not sure. You see, jump out the window and everything would be hunky-dory. Now, have I been here before? Don't know. But I'm going through rooms, and I'm gonna, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, oh, God, Christ. Fuck you, tea or coffee. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna actually do uh, 100 rooms per episode. This place is finally starting to affect me. I've seen enough horror movies to know how to survive a simple ghost or two. But these monsters keep getting faster and stranger. Yeah, and cuter, too. Look at his cute little mouth. He's like, hey, drink me. I'll give you lots of caffeine. Freaking came out of nowhere. I don't know if it was that or the freaking sound it made that was more, that was creepier. I don't know. I simply do not know at the moment. I thought the chair was following me. I'm like, come on. You're not a spooky ass chair. Better hope you're not. Okie doke. I, I, I know I'm going to get scared with every time something jumps out that wall. Oh, I've got choices now. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. My mother told me to pick the very best one, and you are it. Great decisions. Oh, man. Have I been here? This looks f somewhat familiar. Actually, no, it's not. Oh, yeah, it is because I remember going right here, but down this hallway. Let's go this way. Yeah, this is new. I don't remember any of this. I don't remember this picture. Oh. Hmm. Are you giving me... Give me a rope. Give me a place to do it, and I'll do it. I don't care. Hi, Mr. Skull that follows me everywhere. Are we going to go through repeat? Oh. This is new. Room 50. Keep that blood pumping. Your thing, happy smiley heart. And windows that are just... Am I underground? Pillar. Make like a tree and die. Coming this fall. Gotcha. Save. Oh, I'm at a save point. That'd be cool. Well, maybe I can do it every 50 rooms. Yeah. That sounds good. Awesome. You're cool. Oh, yeah, because he's got the little save quill. So he lets me know I can save. Alrighty, guys. Well, it's pretty neat. And depending on the pace of the room, I mean, I killed 50 rooms in 13 minutes. So, um, in the next episode, we're going to continue on. Get spooked by... Oh, oh, I'm going down. That's what I do. Gotcha. All right, well, in the next episode, we're going to get the shit scared of us by cute little things and try to get through all these rooms. But uh, if you guys like the videos I do, make sure you click the subscribe button you see on the screen along with the other videos. But uh, I've been the Leviathan, and this has been Spooky's House of Horrors or whatever it's called. I don't remember. remember HD renovation. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys.